Well, Cyrus, that's a, a tough afternoon and a, a tough defeat to take. Yeah, it was a, it's a tough afternoon and a tough defeat to take. You know, for playing that game, uh, you know, we, we kind of got drawn into to their style of play. And, you know, it was, I'm sure it was an ugly game for the, the people watching. And, you know, we didn't put on a good enough performance. And like I said I've, uh, previously, you know, I'll, I'll hold my hand up for that. For that defending, you know, it was I didn't see it till last minute, and I couldn't react quick enough. And it was a it was a great ball, but other than that, they didn't really have nothing. And you know, it's it's fine margin this game. We've had a couple chances to to maybe take the lead, and and we haven't. And we know as a team we weren't good enough going forward, and we didn't have enough options. And they always make it tough for you. And we just you know we have to to take that risk and and have more confidence in in the way we play and like I said we we probably got drawn into the to the way they played and we know it wasn't good enough and you know we have to look forward now to to Wednesday against Coventry and, and put things right. Uh, you mentioned the the word confidence there in, in terms of the way you you go forward and in games. Do you think it's becoming a, a little bit of an issue Cyrus in in the squad that that confidence thing because you keep conceding the first goal almost? Yeah, I mean, results obviously are going to breed confidence, and you know the results haven't really gone our way. You know, we've we've showed character and resiliency to to get back into games and and come from behind, and you know it's it shouldn't take that for us to to then up the ante in, in the way we perform. And sometimes we it looks like we've we've obviously played better when we've we've gone a goal down, and you know in nature of football usually it's, it is quite easier sometimes to play when when the game opens up and and you're chasing things, and we can't let that be be the game and you know defensively I think we've I believe we've been sound it was just we've conceded from set plays and obviously today we, we conceded from open play and you know we've in the build up to that goal their goal we probably should have done better and we know we're not we're not choosing the right times to put our foot on the ball and be patient and you know we're forcing a lot of things and and ultimately when you're not getting the wins you know it, it goes against you but you know we have to keep believing in ourselves we have to be confident and you know we have to keep trusting each other that the, the results are going to come for us and you know we've gone on a result there where we're four unbeaten I think it was and whatever it may be albeit three of them were draws but you know I'm sure that win's coming and you know there's plenty of football to play this season and you know we have to just keep looking forward we can't dwell on on the past and, and things that are happening we have to go to again in training and, and put things right and you know we said we've got two games coming up now at home and we have to take full advantage of that you're obviously part of training week in uh, day in day out rather and uh, and and i wonder if it if it looks different when you're you're seeing is yourselves on the training pitch than what we're seeing on on the pitch in matches at the moment yeah i mean of course we, we don't really get to train too much at the minute you know with with so many games and, and you know obviously that is is an issue with a new manager coming in he hasn't really had the time to maybe implement his style and and work on a few things but like i said as as individuals as as professionals we have to take responsibility for ourselves we're old enough and wise enough to know that we're not performing good enough and once you step over that white line it's it's about us and about how we perform you know there's there's not much a manager can do once we step over that white line and if we don't perform and we don't create the options for each other and you know we don't pass and we don't move and we don't make things right you know it's it's there's no one else to blame apart from ourselves and you know like I said we we can't dwell on it now we have to look forward and we have to put it right as individuals as, as a team and and look forward to, to Coventry on Wednesday and you know it's, it's going to be another tough game and, and that's the nature of the championship every game is going to be tough but you know if we can perform and if we can we can take our chances and you know it, it's just fine margins and I believe we'll be all right and you know it's it's just about getting that another result another win and and then backing it up with another one and like I said we've got two games now to, to do that and we have to do it right on Wednesday and then look forward to Saturday. Uh, I mentioned earlier conceding the first goal. Do you think it would make a huge difference? I mean, it sounds an obvious thing to say, doesn't it? But yeah. uh, in terms of the confidence and the way a game goes, if you can just get your noses in front in a game, it, it's completely different, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, 100%. I think if you if you look at the, the course of the games and, and the way it's, it's planned out, like I said, we haven't really conceded chances from open play and they've not really had many clear-cut chances. And... And, and as a footballer, as a defender, as a, as a team, when you when you go ahead, it's it's something for you to to hold on to. Albeit, I know it, it sounds it sounds silly, but it's, that's the way it is. And you know that you've got something to build on there. You've got that platform to build on, and you know it it maybe gives you that sense of a bit of relief and a bit more confidence. And you know, like I said, you've got something to hang on to there. And you know, we've, sometimes we've only started playing when we've we've kind of gone behind and. I think today it was just it was a scrappy game. It was ugly. It, it wasn't nice, and you know, as we got drawn into that game, and you know, it, it's not us. And 
you know, like we said, the results in the season hasn't gone as, as we planned, but we have to just keep taking responsibility as adults and as men and, and, and look forward and, and now we have to start making it happen. And, you know, there's, there's plenty of games to play, you know, and we have to go into this next international break we, and we need six points from the next two as, as, and, and as simple as. I was going to say, you have to see it kind of as a chance, don't you, the next couple of games to, yeah. to make that league table look a lot different when you get your next break. Yeah, definitely. I mean, everyone knows what the what the championship is like. You know, if we go win these next two games, you know, everyone forgets about this result today, and you know, all of a sudden the table looks different. You put you put a little run together, and all of a sudden you're you're there in the top half of the table, your top six, whatever it might be. And you know, and we're not massively far behind, but you know, the the gap is getting bigger, and, and we can't allow it to to keep getting bigger. And to, to we set out to obviously get promoted, and, and that, that has to still be the aim. And, and we know there's a bit of ground to make up, but there's a lot of football to be played. And you know, if we can, we can just get them first goals, take our chances. You know, we're defensively as a team, we've we've been pretty solid. And you know, we we know as individuals that it hasn't it hasn't been good enough as a team. And you know, it's like I said, I, I hold my hands up today and for that mistake and for the defending. You know, I probably should do better, but it, it was a tough one to to defend against. And and it's just like I said, fine margins. But we we go again. Mistakes happen in football, but. It's about now putting everything right and making sure it clicks as as, as a team. And you know we've we've definitely got the quality out there in, in the players. You know you look at our squad; it's 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 full of talent. And you know we have to utilise that now.